Thanksgiving week and we found out an event called Families Feeding Families. And it's an amazing Thanksgiving event for uh, people to get a free meal, flu shots, uh, get some clothes. They have uh, spiritual care as well. It's gonna be held at Salem. Mm -hmm. uh, we came out here today, they're setting up and uh, we wanted to get more information and talk to them to see what this event's all about. Let's go check it out. So we are here with Paul with Families Feeding Families. Um, they are getting ready for an event happening this week on Wednesday from 11 to 2. And we were going to come in and ask him a couple questions just about Families Feeding Families. Could you tell us a little bit about that? Sure, sure. Uh, families Feeding Families started about uh, 2011. Okay. Uh, a local businessman saw a need in the community for folks to get a warm Thanksgiving meal that they may not otherwise get. Yeah. And, um, so he started to organize this and for the last 12 years it continues to get bigger and bigger and families get a hot Thanksgiving meal, they get a bag of food that our school kids here at Salem have packed, hygiene kits, haircuts, flu shots, partnerships with uh, some of our community service organizations and so just kind of a one-stop shop. We are expecting about 2,000 people here on this site oh. and then we have another 500 or so meals that are taken to some satellite areas. If you wanted to come get a meal, how would you be able to do that? You just have to show up here at the community center at Salem Lutheran Church, 11 to 2, but people usually start lining up pretty early in the morning. Well, in addition to a, a home-cooked hot Thanksgiving meal, mm -hmm. um, we have a, a large room full of just a mountain of clothing that's been separated into men's and women's and uh, boys, girls, infants, and so people can come through and take whatever they need. Um, they can fill up a trash bag and take it with them. Um, we'll have food bags, hygiene kits, flu shots, haircuts. Our community partners are also going to be here to meet with people and help them um, get connected with some of the resources in the area as well. And for those that don't want to come inside yet or just don't want to get out of the cars, we'll actually have a drive-through lane for those who just want to get the meal and go. If you wanted to come and volunteer or help be involved, how do you go about doing that? Uh, the best way is to sign up in August. Okay. Um, that's when the, usually the, the first registration information goes out. Okay. And so we have about 325 volunteers already signed up to come and work the event itself. So we're full of volunteers. Awesome. And, um, but we're always looking for more next year. Awesome. That's, that's good to know. So if you guys want to help out, look for it, say around August of 2023, and you can sign up to help. Wednesday, this Wednesday, November 23rd, from 11 to 2, um, you don't have to do anything to sign up or to register ahead of time, just show up. Um, best suggestion is though to start showing up early just so that, um, yeah, you can get here. How can businesses in the area get involved? Well, that's a great question. We have a lot of businesses that already do. Um, they, okay. they either donate items or just funds to help us pull this off. Um, we'll, we have a couple members of our board who are pretty active in the community already. Okay. And so if you'd like to donate, it's familiesfeedingfamilies.net. And okay. there's a button on our website that would allow um, individuals or businesses to donate. All right, perfect. Well, thank you so much, Paul. We appreciate it. My pleasure. All right, have a good one. Thanks. All right, so again, this Wednesday, November 23rd from 11 to 2, you don't have to do anything to sign up. Just show up. It's here at Salem Lutheran Church in Tomball, Texas. Uh, we will add the address below. You guys come check it out. Make sure to like, follow us, and that way you will know the area.